Okay, so you have a iPhone or an iPad. I'm going to show you how to hook up your Chromecast device. Okay, so the first thing is we need to do a setup. Okay, before I get into a setup, let me just show you that there are two uh, generations. There is a second generation Chromecast as well as a first generation. Okay, between these two guys, uh, the only difference between these two is slight speed. The second generation is a tad faster. Uh, this one now is like $35 on eBay. The first generation you can get for like $25 on eBay now, okay? So these are exactly the same thing in terms of everything. Setup process, what you can do, what you can do. The only thing is this one's a tad faster, okay? So anyways, when you have the, your uh, Chromecast device, you know, the second generation or the first generation, basically you have a USB cable here, and this is going to power, this is going to give it power, okay? So you have to have, if you don't have a USB port open in the back of your TV, then you have a wall adapter that comes with these uh, Chromecast devices as well. We can just plug that in there, plug and pop it into a wall outlet. Okay, so let me just go ahead and plug this part in. And I'm going to set this one up here too. I just did a factory reset, so we're going to start from the very, very beginning. And like I said, both of these, everything is exactly the same uh, way, okay, in terms of setup, what you can do, what you can do, everything, okay. Now, if you guys want to see the things that it can do and cannot do, look in the link, uh, link below. I'll have a link to that as well for another video, okay? Now, also, um, so I just plugged this in here, too, and it also comes with a uh, HDMI uh, extender here, which this, I mean, you don't need to use this, but basically, if you have a hard-to-reach place for your uh, HDMI, basically, this will just give you, like, a little bit of, like, leeway. So you pop it in, like, one time, and then you always have this... Um, Extra, extra component, your, your female uh, HDMI port, so you can always plug in your Chromecast, or actually you can, you can plug in any other uh, HDMI um, plug in here, but I don't need this because my HDMI port is really easy to access. Okay, so anyways, I have, um, I plugged this in here for my power, and I'm going to plug this part into my HDMI port in the back of my TV, so let me go ahead and do that now. Okay, so from here you can see I have several open HDMI slots, and I do have one open USB port here to give it power. So let me just plug it into like any one of these. This one's fine. Turn it around like this. And let me pop this in there. Just like that. Plug the USB in here to give it power. All right, let me go back to my TV now. Okay, and you can see that's already connecting. Now, don't forget, when you first set this up, though, I already have it on the right HDMI port, but you, what you may have to do is go into your input or your source, and you have to make sure that it's on the correct HDMI port. Okay, well, mine's on HDMI 30 because that's the only one that's highlighted. And then from here, what you want to do is you want to get your iPhone here. And it says right here that um, set up, uh, set me up now. Go to Chromecast slash setup. Actually, what you can do if you have the, um, if you're using a, an iPhone or a uh, iPad, what you simply need to do, or what you can do, is just go into your App Store. So go into your App Store here. And then once this is up, just go to, uh, you can just try type in Chromecast is fine. So, Chromecast, right there. So let me go ahead and press on Enter. And right now the new version, they call it Google Cast instead of Chromecast. But you can type, you can still type in Chromecast and Google Cast will pop up. That's what the icon looks like. So once you install it, go ahead and open it up. And take note, guys, in order for the Chromecast to work, you guys have to have Wi-Fi network. If you don't have a Wi-Fi network, then you can't do anything, okay? Okay, so now what we have to do from here is basically, let me focus in on here. You want to click on Devices here. You want to click on Add New Device. And then we want to go to the first one up here. It says Chromecast. 
And then from here it says connect your Chromecast in the Wi-Fi setting. Okay, so now what you want to do is just go into your settings here. Go into Wi-Fi. And then you want to look for the uh, Chromecast, which is, let me focus in on here. It's a 6786. If you look on my phone, you see 6786 right here. So I'm going to press on this. Let it connect. And then once it connects, I'm going to go back to the uh, Google Cast app. Okay, it's connected. Now I'm going to go back to the uh, Google Cast app, which is right there. And now you can see it says awaiting instructions. Now I'm going to press on next here. Let's set up Chromecast 6786. Press on next. Do you see this code T6, T9? I see it right there. So I'm going to click on I see the code. Click on my region. I am in the US right now. So I'm going to click on next. And you can rename this anything you want to rename it to. I'm just going to keep it at the default and just click on next. And now what I have to do is go to my, my Wi Fi network in my house. So let me go ahead and click on uh, the Wi Fi there. And then I'm going to look for my network here in my home, which is this right here, this T <clears throat> TG, and let me enter my password. Then I'm going to press on setup. And take note guys, another big thing is too between if you're using the iOS device, you cannot screen mirror, okay? In other words, you cannot AirPlay with Chromecast with your iOS device. However, you can screen mirror if you have an Android device. Okay, there you go. And now it says uh, ready to cast. If you look at my phone here, so that you can browse, um, browse and cast your app. So basically, for a quick example, let me just go into like YouTube here and pick a video here and I'll go ahead and click on the casting icon click on my Chromecast 6786 bam we're in business anyways uh, look at my link below guys I'll have more information on what you can do and what you can't do with your um, your iOS device on um, Chromecast and that's pretty much it thanks for watching guys bye